Hello boys, last one. Uh, as you might imagine, I'm going to do a lager. I mean, look, the lager this one is going to be, surprisingly, it's going to be a Moretti. But it's going to be out of the bottle. I have got uh, kegs of it, but I'm going to do bottled Moretti. Um, which basically is Moretti, isn't it? I'm fucking kegs or fucking bottles, who gives a shit? Uh, so, yeah, so, um, filled the, just for, to make myself look pretty classy, I've put it in a glass. Mm. Mm. I like the initial taste, must admit. So I'm going to give that a four. I think it's quite smooth. And um, I like the smell as well. It's not one of those fucking dirty lagers, is it? Like Foster's or like... Avocado in top, please. Fuck off. Get out. Yeah, aftertaste. Yeah, slips down nicely. No problem at all from me. Give that another... It's not perfect. I know it's not perfect. I'm not... I'm not deluded. I know it's not fucking perfect, but I'm going to give it a four as well. Um, branding, I mean, it's just got some Italian geezer in it, like just sat in a hat from the Euster Valley or something. Um, so I don't think that's great. Uh, it's a little bit old school, isn't it? It's a three. What's that? Four, four, three? A bit like what West Ham want to play. And um, piss rating, I mean, I drink it in bucket loads, so. It gets me seriously shit faced, but it's only 4.5, 4 4.6%. So I'm gonna have to go three realistically, aren't I? So four, four, three, three. So 14, 14 out of 20. So really, I mean, brand up the Ultip Pizna. Um, basically equals the Moretti, but I prefer the Moretti because it's nicer, isn't it? So yeah, there's my three little reviews. Well, here's my view down the down the garden at the moment. Mrs. Benjo's in the house. So I'm just going to pop to the shed for a bit of beer tasting. Fuck off. So what? So what? It's my fucking shed. <laughs>